Glad to have you with us in the studio. I'm Reese Davis, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. The Buckeyes have met every challenge on their schedule so far this season. But that doesn't mean the challenges stop. In fact, the stakes just get higher, and another challenge is coming up right now. We've done all we can do here. Time to tee it up. Let's send it out to Brad and Kirk for the call. David and I will be with you at halftime. For today's exciting football matchup. Before we head down to the field for the coin toss, we'd like to remind you this game is brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coke taste, zero calories. Enjoy everything. We'll see how this game plays out as they get ready for the opening kickoff. He'll take it from the two. At the 30. He's knocked out of bounds. They'll bring him down around the 46-yard line. From the 46-yard line, it's first down. He might have a chance. He's at the 30 to the 20. Touchdown, Buckeyes! Offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. And they get a few yards from their own 27-yard line. Second down. Quick throw out to the receiver. Brought down around the 38-yard line. Oh gosh, what are you doing? You're throwing that into coverage. But only he knows the confidence that he has in his wide receiver to have the ability to come down with the football for that first down. That's big time there between the quarterback and the wide receiver. Quick pass, man open, and he dropped it. From their own 38-yard line. Second down. He's taken down right around the 46-yard line. They're one of the loudest crowds in the country, and they are on their feet. And he just gets rid of it. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. Tackle right around the 20. Bailey, left side. He's out to the 30. Tackle made right around the 36. Now he tries to buy some time. And a quick throw. To the 20. The 10. It's away from him. Touchdown. Stop behind the line from their own 23-yard line. It's second down. Screen pass. He's got his halfback. And they make the stop right around the 26-yard line. Really one of the very tough places to play in college football, and it's no different today. And down he goes. He 
he's tackled at the 43. These fans are showing you why teams hate to come here, folks. Nice grab on the play. And he's tackled around the 33-yard line. He scrambles. Slides down to the ground. It's second down. Makes the catch and gets out of bounds. He's going to try and scramble. He's taken down at the 10. Caught and he's hit immediately. It's arguably the loudest crowd in the nation and they are turning it up a notch. Now he's scrambling. They'll bring him down at the one yard line. This defense not wanting to give an inch here. Touchdown, Scarlet Knights. He makes it to the 28-yard line. He might have a chance. And he hits him hard at the 44. I like how efficient the offense looked on that play. run there as they work the outside. Going deep. Lays it out there. Caught. Huge gain and that sets him up. All the big boys are on the field now. Both teams have their big sets out there. Last week right he loses yard. Let's see if they try to pound it in here. Both teams have their goal line sets on the field. Fires off play action, touchdown! You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead, and on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. Fires out to his receiver. The 50, brought down at the 44-yard line. Quick throw, and he's got his receiver again. And he's taken down at the 36. There's a player down. Check three, check three, check three. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Three yards to get the first down here on third down. This crowd can really be intimidating for an opposing team. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Tackle around the 15-yard line. Quick strike to the receiver. Touchdown, Rutgers! Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Ohio State is up seven. He makes it out to maybe the 43. Second down, eight yards to go. Ball on the 43. Gets it out quickly. Tackle made at about the 49. Gets out to around the 38. What we're seeing right now is just a great connection. Run right. 
and hit in the backfield. It's never good for a back's confidence to get tackled for a loss. Second down and 11. Ball on the 16-yard line. Ohio State is up a score. Powers on the give. Makes it to the 8. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. Last drive ended with as good a result as you can hope for, and I'm sure they'd like to replicate that here. You know, when this defense went over to the sideline based on the way they've been playing so far, this defense coordinator has got to be livid. He's got to get in their face. He's got to challenge them. He's got to get their emotions going. From their own 25-yard line, it's second down. They go to the back, and he's hit immediately in the backfield. We've played a half of football here. Ohio State's lead is two touchdowns. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Steve Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. The pass rush of both teams has been totally negated in the first half. Neither team has been able to come up with a sack. So what's the D-line coach right now preaching to you guys up front, you big fellows who love to go there and make life miserable for a quarterback? Well, you got to watch the football and get off it as soon as you can and try to get that first step quickness because I know those guys are big and strong, but they're also a little bit chunky. And if you're on the defensive line and you're, you're a little bit slimmer and you get off the football a little bit faster, but try to get off that ball quick. And it's not just sacks where you see. How about you affect the quarterback? How about you, you bull rush your guy and you put him in his lap and you make him throw over top or, you know, change the throwing angle so he doesn't have a clean pocket where he can step up in there and make big throws the whole game. You've got to do something, something different than you did the first half to affect the quarterback. I can only hope that Nestler and Herb Street will bring the same type of intensity to their call of the second half that David and I have brought to the halftime show. Of course, they always do. That's it for us here in the studio. Time to get you back out to the guys for the second half. Welcome you back to the action here. Just about set for the second half. He sends this one deep. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Nice run, and he's brought down. Second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Gains his way to the 39-yard line. 13, 13. And he throws it away. Looking for his man, incomplete. They'll spread the field with five wide. Makes the catch and gets out of bounds. Great play and he'll lose yards. Throws complete, big loss. The third down here and this time it's third and long. The Scarlet Knights running back sidelined earlier with that injury. Right now, though, it looks like he's uh, warming up, trying to get back in the ballgame. Throws on the run, interception. He's on the run. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. To the 10. Touchdown, Ohio State. See how the defense responds now, coming off that big play just a moment ago. This quarterback needs to be a little bit more careful because this defense is excellent on capitalizing off the mistakes. And he's tackled at the 22. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. And they've got the dime package in there to try and deal with this five receiver look. Quick pass. Knocked out of bounds. 
First and ten. Ball on the 38. Makes it out to about the 46. Completes. It's the junior. And down he goes. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 38-yard line. And he just gets rid of it. Throws complete. He's got space to work. He's taken down. Around the 23. Inside the 10, and he's pushed out of bounds. And they make the stop at the 8-yard line. He's tackled at the 2-yard line. They're crowding the line. Dives, and he's down. Webster picks up two yards with a carry. He gets it up, and it splits the upright. And he's taken down around the 32-yard line. They'll bring him down at the 41 yard line. Great job by the running back. Three down, three down. Hey, check right, check right. Got his receiver, dropped it. Incomplete. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Makes the catch, and he's got nowhere to go. A great tackle at midfield. Tackle at about the 47 yard line. Nice run there. another hand on. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Got some open field. Tackle made. And they get nice yardage on that run. The halfback with a carry. Nice run there as they work the outside. Boy, that's another first down. Looking for the corner. Touchdown, Buckeyes! Don't expect any once-in-a-lifetime rallies here, but that being said, we could still see some exciting plays. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Less than three minutes in the game. He gets rid of this one. Now he's scrambling. Runs with it, and he's got room. Brought down around the 45-yard line. Motion, motion, motion. He 
defense coming and the ball comes out. Picks up the fumble. And he tackles him hard. Shift could be in the making here as we take a look at the possible fumble. They're going to review this fumble, and I've got to tell you, I think he was down before the ball popped loose. I don't know about this one, Brad. They called it a fumble on the field, and they need indisputable video evidence. From their own 45-yard line, second down. Again with a carry. They'll get him for a loss. Fires complete over the middle. And he's level at the 46-yard line. Late in the fourth quarter, this game has been a blowout for quite some time. And Kirk and I are just looking to make our flights. A little over a minute in the game. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. And he makes it out to about the 24-yard line. Well, a nice stop there late in the fourth quarter, but it's a blowout and has been for most of the game. I think it's time for everybody to go home. Today we saw a game that wasn't even close. Ohio State, 42. Rutgers, 17. So that wraps things up for us. For EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit. I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time.